Hello everyone, this is Lunar and welcome to more for Emblem Heroes. Last time we had a Bound Hero battle against Fjorn and Nepho, and today have a brand new legendary hero battle against uh, Elincia, the Undaunted Queen. Not the Undead Queen, as I said before. <laughs> in, in one of the attempts of doing this video, but yeah, anyway. Let's go over to the special maps and I present the team. Uh, we have Robin. Nobody goes along with the plans of a tactician they don't trust, right? We have Ike. We have Dimitri. And we have Robin. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for believing in me. I think Robin is the only one that are feeling talkative today, anyway. And this will be a Alto. Elysia on um, down to the Queen. Inferno difficulty here on Fire Emblem Heroes. Yes. I also play this and I'm not even joking about it. I have my my animation on so I don't need to matter uh, move with that. No matter the age or world, conflict always seems to be brewing. Will we ever see an end to it? Well, you're going to see an end to this fight, specifically. But yeah, you know, aside from that, uh, I, I don't think it'll ever happen. Anyway, well, let's also play this, right? Um, you know, as I mentioned on the uh, your Nephil video. I renew my US visa, so now I can go again to the US for I don't know how long. It could be five years, it could be ten years. I'll only know in like uh, 11 days or something? 11 to 15 days or something like that. Um, and yeah, I was very tense about it. I thought I wouldn't manage to renew my visa. But I think one of the things that uh, counted in my favor uh, was the fact that I went to the US recently, and, you know, back in May, May 17th to May 31st, and that helped uh, me renew my visit because it showed that uh, I didn't want to stay at the US, I just want to go there and visit, and that's basically what I want to do, <laughs> Just I just want to visit the parks. Yeah, you're not gonna kill me. <laughs> and and because of that, uh, you just thought, wow, who we're going with? I said, you know, I usually go to the US with my mom. And I say usually, but always I go with my mother. Uh, it's just better to go with someone to the US than go alone. And you have fun with the on the park. So I think those were the two things that come towards uh, me getting my visa again. And the fact that, you know, I already had the visa, just was renewing it. And I don't know if the console actually liked me. She was moving uh, her hair, I mean, thinking way too much into that. Uh, <laughs> anyway, not very looking for any romantic thing. Uh, not there, anyway. And basically, um, I went there and it was like 8 p.m., 8 a.m. that, that I reached the, the console. I had a little bit of a traffic uh, going on our way there. Uh, I wake up at 5 a.m. <laughs> for, that, for that interview. And my appointment was at 8.30. Um, so I just, well, I just got a day to actually do the interview at 11. And it was basically it. Like, they started doing the queue for the... Uh, for 8.30 at 9.45, not even joking with you. There was a little bit of a commotion in the line uh, before you enter the, the, the console uh, area, the actual inside area. Uh, and basically it was an old man trying to skip the line, apparently. There was a lady complaining with him about it, basically shouting that he was skipping the line. Nothing came out of it, no, nobody did anything about that, just was heated uh, discussion and I actually got blocked it there and but aside from it, it was pretty normal just waiting you know just did what I had to do my photos actually uh, loaded uh, for me to go to the interview I did not have to take a, a picture outside of it I was basically that it was pretty smooth all the way through except the fact that I had a, you know was a very slow kill <laughs> anyway uh, Anyway, thanks everyone for watching. Sorry for the handling. Uh, get your Forbes and some on the button available source right now. Bye bye.